By the way, I'm Lawrence Malandra, 24 years old, and I'm from Impasog, Bukidnon, and I am a teacher at the same time coach in Malibala City Division, and I am a teacher also, and a uh, sports coordinator in Kasisang Senior High School. And one of my favorite nga team sa PBA is the Henebra because based on my observation with their I know with their team gabi ka the best ilang rotation gabi ka pasensyo so ilang mga coaches at the same time gabi ang philosophy sa ilang team which is gabi ka focus good o gabi ka strong ilang relationship towards playing towards outside and inside the court so that's why inan ko sa Enebra and sa NBA ang ganan ko nga team is the Raptors at the same time ang um, Golden State Warriors because not by the players but the same Japan the way they handle the team the way coaches handle the team the way the players play inside the court grabe lang uh, positioning they do their role as a player and of course ang same Japan ang defense ang ball rotation and others that's why inan ko sa two teams I'm not a varsity player but uh, since young and since when I was in elementary kaduna na ko basketball ang third high school paingon sa paingon so that's why I have a lot of experience because of course here in Mindanao, grabe ka uh, daghan dula. But so far, karon nga panahon is na stop ka Pero anyway, um, daghan ka ma experience ng mga tao, daghan ka ma experience ng mga classic classic ng mga players. That's why uh, daghan ka matunan. There is a uh, Mindanao, especially here in Quidnon. Uh, my greatest achievement as a player, since when I was a player, is of course, pinaka goal yun na ko is mag champion. Then, uh, of course, na reach na ko ng goal with my teammates. And at the same time, pinaka achievement yun na ko is mag improve as a player. I've been coaching for almost five years. Yeah, I started coaching the year 2016. Then, nag-start ko sa kumbaga coach because of my passion. And of course, one of the person yun yung nagtudlo sa kuwa sa kumbaga coach and nag-mentor sa kuwa on how to do things, how to work things in the court is of course si Kung head coach siya una sa kong pag-start sa coach, si Coach Raymond Mercader. So, shout out, coach. Then, uh, sa kong pagsugod sa kong pag-coach is not that easy. But then, kung siya, challenging. Then, lisod siya, lisod siya. Pero, ma-enjoy rin mo after nakimakita ang mga developments sa imong mga players. Uh, one of the things good nga akong na-achieve sa pagsugod o coach at, at the same time, ang tod ka is ang pag-develop sa akong attitude and pag-improve uh, sa akong mga kailangan buhaton towards uh, teaching. So, dako kaya siyang tabang para sa ko because I can adjust sa tanan ng butang. So, na-apply na ko siya inside and outside the court. So, muna siyang pinaka dako na kong achievement. I know nga we have different philosophies to different styles in coaching but then one of our goal good is to uh, make sure nga ma-improve pa nga ito mga players. So, ako ang style sa pag-coach and pag-train sa mga bata is more like spiral. So, dili lang ako mag-focus more on improving 
them towards playing basketball but at the same time may improve po na ko sila uh, sa ilang attitude yung magamit nila sa basketball and sa outside basketball so my point is magamit nila sa ilang uh, tagsa-tag sa uh, panginabuhi so first of all is ina-improve yun ang uh, nako ang attitude sa bata okay once ang bata wala attitude is though shall we say ano siya um, may siya modula ka bata but then wala siya attitude so we need to develop that first para mas mumaayo pag ang bata so muna kang pinaka goal so ang attitude magamit niya inside and outside the court and follow na rin ang mga other things sa pagdula o pagpa-improve sa mga bata towards skills and other uh, methods na kailangan niya improve one of the challenges that I've encounter of being a coach is of course kanang I mean it's all about parent okay I mean uh we cannot deny the fact that sometimes ang ilang parent na mag uh, singita mag coach during sa game so as a child as a player sa high magduwa na sila kung kinsay paminaw either ang parent nila or ang coach yun but personally speaking uh, usahay digi malikayan sa bata nga dito na gyud maminaw so challenge siya para sa ako cuz dili na masunod ang among play dili ma buhat sa bata kung unsa yang dapat buhaton kay lahi na ang, ma- ang mapabuhat so that's why uh, it is one of the challenges that I've encountered of being a coach so far para sa mga kabataan and uh, para sa mga players is of course do your part do your part as a player do, do your part as a student yan naman kung dilit ni mo buhaton ng isa possibly ka ma-down at the end yan naman um Example is uh, you are a good player, but then wala ka nagtarong sa imong pag-skwela. So, na ay 20. For me, 20%, 80% ang akong pag-bahin uh, na ng, pag ng 20%. Posible ka mo padayan sa imong basketball career. 80% nga, ano, dili. Dili ka makapadayon. So, kung siya kailangan ni Mubahaton is, uh, again, do your part as a student and at the same time as a player. So, kailangan ni Mubahaton siya do, uh, biraho ng dua, buhato ng dua. Kay, as we all know, dili hangtod sa hangtod ang pagtulag basketball. So, kailangan na ito, buhato na ito ang part nga kailangan ta mo graduate kailangan ta magtarong og skwela kay at the end you will earn good ang unsa yung gihaguan sa court og sa pagskwela so daghan players daghan na mga tao daghan na mga kabataan karon nga gusto lang sila magdula pero at the end of the day sila ra gyapo nagbabasol so that's why kailangan na to buhaton ang tanan para sa ulahi kita riyapon ang mag uh, ani sa ato mga gipang tanong. So again, hard work tapos kwila gyud, kwila. Mahalang mo ginaunsa. And my message to all the coaches uh, be positive lang tayo coaches and uh, sooner or later wala ra japo ning covid this pandemic then we will continue our job and to meet our players again personally and of course continue the works that we started that's all So
Cause 